Hi all, now Niels from KnifeNow.com as you can see uh, and uh, today what I want to do is quickly focus on uh, the basics of bladesmithing okay now basically what it is uh, you've got a forge and uh, what you're going to do is you're going to heat up a piece of flat bar standard stock flat bar so you can do this like that and uh, as you can see is uh, you've got square corners there okay and what you need to do step one is you're obviously going to be working off those corners okay step two you're then going to be rounding those corners all right and then step three is you're going to start to shape the actual knife now keep in mind i'm just going to put this down that that section there okay is actually going to be the spine of the knife and not the cutting edge okay and we'll cover that why at a, at a later point in time or these three steps here okay is the standard way of doing it let me just pan out there we go that's the standard way of doing it or if you're a lazy ass like me you can actually just cut to the chase literally cut what i do is i take an angle grinder and uh, the die harders out there might uh, disagree with me but basically what i do is take an angle grinder and uh, i cut take my piece of flat stock bar i literally take an angle grinder i cut off an edge there and i cut an or if off an edge there <laughs> and i then then grind this down and that gets me a quick start uh, to that which is very damn close to uh, step number three and I haven't heated the metal yet I haven't screwed it up and uh, there we go from about 10 minutes if you do if you know what you're doing well not really 10 minutes uh, from starting your forge to uh, that point there that was around about 10 minutes if you know what you're doing you can do that in about five minutes or you can just cut that down and grind it and it'll cost you uh, in, in seconds all right well that was a quick tip for today Remember KnifeNow.com and what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave you with a photo um, or a, a view on uh, my last knife making attempt. Now that one there has actually been etched. It is a leopard's face on a hunter skinner that I bought from my brother and uh, hopefully he'll come pick it up tomorrow. Uh, there we go. Boys, enjoy and uh, we'll cover etching in a, in a later video. Thanks gents, enjoy. Remember knifeknowhow.com if you don't know we might not know either but at least we'll find out thanks cheers